The prolonged drought in Korea devastated farmland in some areas and driving up food prices. Not only is it causing shortages for industry and ordinary people, a population of insects has gone out of control. Yi Yunshin takes a closer look. Yedang Reservoir, located in Chungcheongnamdo Province, has been known as the best fishing place in Central Korea for the past two decades. But due to lack of rain this year, the nation's largest reservoir has dried up. Instead of floating on water, fishing boats are just standing still on cracked earth. Severe drought has destroyed the habitats of the creatures that usually dwell in the reservoir. And the lack of water for agriculture has also damaged the local farming industry. The field where I planted rice seeds is all dried out and cracked. I'm really hoping it rains soon. Things aren't that much different in the nation's northeast Gangwondo province. In Hwengsong County, insects have unleashed a nightmare on the local residents. Greenery is fading away across the mountains and woodland. For a couple of weeks now, a plague of emperor moth caterpillars has been feeding on trees in the area and even plants inside greenhouses, affecting some 200 hectares. Plants attacked by these caterpillars die within a few weeks, especially in the hot, dry weather. The caterpillars have no natural predator in the region, and with the drought, their numbers have been expanding out of control. Due to the severe lack of rain, the damage from these caterpillars has been increasing. We're doing everything we can to minimize the damage, but it's been very difficult. As the drought has been getting worse every year, experts are concerned that the damage this year may expand beyond agriculture across the country. Yunshin, Arirang News.